All right, hi everyone. It's Nicole from Special Olympics Connecticut. Really excited to kick off our 321 Fitness Challenge today. Uh, we have a special health leader with us today, Angie D'Amico, to kick us off with the level one workout. Um, so Angie, you want to introduce yourself and tell us a little bit about you? Sure. My name is Angie D'Amico. I'm a health leader. I am from Cheshire. And my favorite support is soccer. And I'm happy to join the 330 World with my colleague Nicole. Awesome. So we are going to be doing um, a couple endurance exercises, a couple strength exercises, and then we'll cool down with some flexibility stretches at the end. Um, so you should be able to follow this workout from home. You don't need any equipment and you should be able to get your 30 minutes of physical activity with us today. So we are going to start with our endurance workouts. We're going to do jumping jacks, uh, marching in place and quick punches. So um, Angie and I will lead for you guys and you can just follow along with us. So we will warm up with our endurance exercises. All right, Angie, are you ready? I am. So we're gonna start with jumping jacks. So we're gonna do 10 of them. Do you wanna count for the first round and I'll count for the second round? Sure. All right, so ready in three, two, one. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Awesome. All right, so the next exercise we're going to do is marching in place. So all we're doing is lifting our knees and swinging our arms. So we're going to do ten of these, and both knees up counts as one. All right, so I'll count these. Are you ready? Three, two, one, start. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, nice job. So the next is we're gonna do um, quick punches. So if you want, you can bend your knees a little bit, arms up front, and you're just gonna punch across. All right, and you wanna count us for this one? Sure. Ready, three, two, one. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nice job. All right, so now we're gonna have a one minute rest. And this would be a really good time for you guys to grab some water if you need it. Um, and just feel yourself getting warmed up for a workout, all right? So I have my water right here I'm gonna grab. And uh, we have about 30 seconds left. And we're going to do that all over again. All right, so we'll start with the jumping jacks again. And you want to count us for that one? Sure. All right, so ready in three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nice job. All right, do you remember what was next? The high knees. Yep. Awesome. All right, so we're going to do high knees again, and I'll count us out for this one. Ready? Three, two, one. 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 Two. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Nice job. All right, do you remember what was next? The punching. Yep. So we're going to do a little squat, punch across. All right, and you want to count us off? Sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Awesome, and your dog is going to come work out with us. So we're going to do another one minute rest, and then we're going to do that for one more round. All right, so this time, See if you can do your jumping jacks a little bit faster. See if you can do your high knees a little bit faster if you want, and even the quick punches. Because this is our last round of warm up before we're gonna start our strength exercises, all right? So grab some water if you have it. All right, so we got about 10 more seconds until our last round. 
So again, we're going to start with jumping jacks, and Anne, you'll count for us, okay? Got it. Awesome. All right, ready? Three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Awesome. Nice job. All right. Do you feel nice and warmed up? Oh, yeah. All right, good. So you should feel your heart pumping. You should feel yourself getting a little bit hotter. Maybe we're starting to sweat a little bit. Um, so we're nice and warmed up with our endurance exercises. And we're going to do another minute of rest. But while we're resting, I'll tell you guys what's coming next. So we're going to do some strength exercises. So the first one's going to be a leg raise. So find a spot on the wall if you need a little bit of help with balance. And we're going to kick our leg forward and out. So that counts as a one. And then we're going to do push-ups. And again, you can use the wall for this. So find a spot on the wall. And you're going to push in. Keep your body nice and straight. And you're going to use your upper body strength for this one, OK? The last one is we're going to do a curl up. So if you're on the rug, you can use that. But if you're not, you can just use a blanket or a towel. So you're going to lay on your back, knees bent hands on your legs, and go up. OK, so we'll do 10 of each of those. We'll rest for one minute, and then we'll do that again. And for the legs for the second round, we're going to switch sides. So you might want to find a spot on another wall for the second round, OK? So these exercises are what's really going to help you guys with your 3 two, one fitness exercises that you chose. So we're going to practice all of these for eight weeks, and hopefully by the end of the eight weeks, you're going to have higher scores, and you're going to be able to do more push-ups or more squats or more curl-ups than you were able to do this week for week one. All right? So we're going to start with leg raises. So find your spot on the wall if you need to. And uh, Angie, you want to count for us for this one? Yes. So remember, going out, and to the side is one. So you'll count every time we kick to the side, OK? Ready, set, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten. Nice job. All right, so the next one is push ups. So again, find that spot on the wall. And the last one was for lower body strength. This is going to help our upper body strength. All right, so I'll count us for this one. Are you ready, Ang? Absolutely. All right. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. Nice job. So our next one is we're going to work on core strength. So we're going to do curl ups. And that really helps us um, to build strength, like I said, in our core, which helps us stand up straight, uh, run faster, and just really helps with our overall strength. OK, so we're going to lay on the floor. With our knees bent. Awesome. Hands on our legs. And then up to our knees is one. All right. So, Ann, do you want to count us for this one? Uh, sure. OK, ready, set, go. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nice job. All right, so we finished our first round of strength exercises. So now, like I said, grab some water again. We're going to rest for one minute, and then we'll do that all over again. How are you feeling, Ange? 
Good. Awesome. So again, next time we're going to switch legs. So if you need to hold on to something, you're just going to use the other arm and you'll just kick out and to the side again with the opposite leg. Same thing for push-ups for this next round against the wall and same things for curl-ups, okay? All right. So, and whenever you're ready, we can start with our other leg. Okay. You feel good? Yeah. All right. Awesome. So I'll count us for this one, all right? So in three, two, one, you're going to kick forward and to the side. One. Four. Two. Five, two. Three. Yeah. Four. Five. Woo. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. One more. Ten. Ten. Awesome. Nice job. All right, so we're back to the push-up. So find your spot on the wall. And if you want to do something a little bit harder, another variation is that you can get down on the floor and you can do a push-up on your knees like this. Or you can do a full push-up like that. All right, so those are your three different options. Ange and I are going to find our spot on the wall. Okay, so legs back. Ange, you want to count us for this one? Sure. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nice job. All right, so our last one is curl up. So we're going to get on the floor. Hands on our knees again, on our legs, knees bent. And we're gonna do 10. So I'll count us for this one. Ready? Three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten. Nice job. All right. So you get another one minute of rest. Grab some water, and then we'll do our cool down. How are you feeling, Ange? Thumbs up. Okay. Awesome. All right, so while we're resting, I'll go through our next um, exercises, which is going to be some flexibility stretches to kind of cool us down from the workout. So the first one is we're going to do a calf stretch. So you're going to find your spot on the wall again. One leg, you're going to kick up, like a kickstand onto the wall, and the other leg is going to fall back behind you and you're gonna lean forward on the wall and you should feel the stretch on the leg that's up on the wall. So we'll hold each of those for 30 seconds on each leg. Then we're gonna get into child's pose. So you're gonna fold on your knees, sit back, and you're gonna reach forward. And this is a really good stretch for your back and your lower body from those lower body exercises that we did. The next one, you're gonna lay on your back, kick one leg out, and bring one leg into your chest. So we'll do two with Nicole? each of those. What was that, Ange? Do you two with when you do that? Do I what? To with. Oh, nope, you're just gonna hold it. Okay. And then we'll switch. All right. So let's start with the calf stretch. I'll grab my timer. All right. So 
So we're gonna, like I said, find your spot on the wall, put one foot up on the wall and one foot back, and we're gonna lean in for 30 seconds, okay? This is a really good stretch for our lower body, for our calves. All right, so we got about three seconds, two, one, and we're going to switch other leg, foot up, lean in, and we'll start our 30 seconds right now. And if you want a little bit of a deeper stretch in the back leg, you can always step it back even farther. All right, so we got about 10 seconds. And three, two, one, nice job. All right, so next one, like I said, you're gonna kneel down on your knees, sit back on your feet, and we're gonna reach forward as far as we can. And we're gonna hold this for 30 seconds, all right? Uh, we're halfway done. About 10 more seconds. Nice job. All right. So now we're going to sit back down, lie on our back. We're going to kick one leg forward bring one leg up to our chest, and we're gonna hug it towards us. So we'll hold this for 30 seconds. Halfway done. And five, four, three, two, one. We're gonna switch. So take that leg out, bring the other one in towards your chest and hug it. And we'll hold this one for 30 seconds. All right, nice job. So that is our workout. So if you wanted to um, repeat this workout one more time, um, you would have hit a little bit over our 30 minute exercise goal. Um, and you can rewatch this, replay this video. You can also use the workout that's in the 321 fitness guide. And this will really help you to improve your um, exercises for the three, two, one fitness challenge. All right. So Angie, thank you so much for joining and helping us with the workout. How do you feel? Sweaty. Yeah. Good. That's the <laughs> point. Imagine if you did it again. Yeah. Awesome. All right. Well, uh, we will see you back next week for level two and you can join us, um, during our workout Wednesday live zoom session this Wednesday afternoon. All thank right. You. Thanks, Angie.